que estén bien y en este video vamos a describir fotos usando el vocabulario que hemos aprendido durante el día número 1 y día número 2 de la semana número 4 de esta serie. So, aquí está el vocabulario y como ustedes pueden ver, vamos a hablar sobre things in a bedroom, ¿ok? Y ahora vamos a hablar en inglés. So, como ustedes pueden ver, as y'all can see, this picture shows a bedroom, right? A bedroom. Um, we can see that there is a bed, right? There is a bed, una cama. There are also lamps. There are lamps. Una lámpara aquí y una lámpara aquí, right? There's a lamp here and a lamp here. This is a night table, right? There is a night table. There is a window, una ventana. There are cortinas, curtains, right? There is a chair right here, a chair. There are paintings right here, there are paintings. There's a wall right here, a wall. And there is a rug right here at the bottom on the floor. On the floor, there is a rug. Now, what color is the bed? What color is this? It's sort of white. It is kind of pink as well, right? Un poco em, rosado un poco blanco, right? Y aquí está el vocabulario para hablar sobre diferentes colores, right? To talk about colors. So, usando um, el vocabulario, vamos a describir o hablar sobre los colores, right? So, what color is this? It's blue, right? It is blue. What color is the night table? The night table is white. The lamps are also white. Okay? This wall is gray. It is a gray wall. And the curtains, las cortinas, are purple right and so that is all there is to describe in this photo good job all right ahora vamos a describir otra foto usando el vocabulario que hemos aprendido durante el día número dos de la semana número cuatro okay so aquí está una foto right y hay diferentes personas, hay dos hombres en el foto, pero necesitamos describir esta foto en inglés. So, as y'all can tell, there are two men in this picture. And they are working on, they, they, they seem to be working on something. They seem to be designing something, right? Designing. ¿Dónde está la palabra? Um, ¿dónde está? They are designing something, right? They seem to be as if they are architects, arquitectos, right? This man right here is holding a pencil, and this man is holding a pen. He is holding a pen. So one man is holding a pencil and the other man is holding a pen. They are both wearing white shirts. The two architects are wearing white shirts. There is a green marker in the photo right here. The woman in the photo has a pen in her hand as well. Or maybe it is a marker, a marker. There is a cell phone 
on the table and the table is white. The table is white. The two men are very ambitious. They are working very hard and being very efficient with their time. It is important for them to communicate well so they can design their houses correctly and to manage their company. It is very important to know how to work together so they can sell their product with ease in una manera muy fácil. The two men, oh, one man is wearing glasses, gafas, and the other man is not. And these people in the photo are all wearing white shirts, white shirts. And that is all for this photo. Let's describe another photo. Okay, now we have this photo right here. As we can see, there is a factory, right? Una fábrica. There's a factory. ¿Dónde está la palabra? Right? There is a factory. And there are many people, muchas personas, that are working in this factory. Que están trabajando in la fábrica. There are many women and men who have to work together. There is a truck right here. There are some boxes, cajas. There, is, there are some people working on computers. There are some people presenting their idea. There is a very big cell phone, right? A cell phone. There are, hmm, let's see. There are drones. There are drones. There are people analyzing statistics. Analyzing statistics. Personas que están analizando diferentes estadísticas. There are more people working on computers. There are people who want to buy products. Personas que quieren comprar diferentes productos. There are many people walking around. And there are many people, look, this person right here oh, is using their cell phone. Están usando su, su, celula, su celular, right? There are many people working together, working very hard in this photo. And that is it for today, right? Oh, right. No, no, no. The people in this photo must sell their product and provide service. These people right here are selling a product. They are providing service, right? They're providing service. Okay, that is all for today. Thank you for watching. And if you didn't understand me, that is okay. Maybe you can listen to my vocabulary video again. You must continue to listen to music so you get used to listening to music and hearing the language of English, and maybe you can watch some other videos of mine so you can mejorar tu comprensión, okay? Eso es todo para hoy. Gracias por ver y adiós.